Hey everyone, welcome back. So finally, I've decided to upload Mage.js microservices full course video. I think you all guys are asking for this video for a long time and this video will be uploaded next week. But before that, I just wanted to uh, upload this small video, right? So this video, I'm going to give you some of the overview and prerequisite that you need to know. So please don't skip this. But before that, I wanted to discuss a couple of points. You can see that I clearly mentioned one point and that is video recording uh, time is one month. Now, I normally don't do these kind of things in any of my previous videos but for this one i'm actually doing and the reason is you are not going to believe this video took me more than one month to record and i've given a lot of effort so this is my single request from all of you when i'm going to upload this video please watch the video for five minutes see it's absolutely fine it's a long video you can go back whenever you'll get some time again we'll come back and watch the video but the moment i'm going to upload this right let's on monday if you don't watch this what will happen youtube is going to bring that video immediately right so whatever effort that i've given that will be gone so this is my single request i will upload the video on monday just watch the video for five minutes then you can close it then again whenever you'll get some time you can come back and watch again so now let's discuss some more points see i'll go to my uh, youtube okay so i just search for nature's microservices and you'll see that there is not a single proper video now see from my side what i can do right you'll see my teaching that how i've created this uh, particular video and not only that there will be more than four to five videos that i'm going to upload on nature's microservices if i want i can easily make this one a udemy paid course but i'm not going to do that i'm going to upload each and every video all the five videos for free for all of you okay now there are a couple of things that you need to understand that is some of the prerequisites that are very very important that's why actually i'm creating this video or else when you watch that video that video might seem very advanced level okay because see nasgis is actually a little bit complicated so you need to understand a lot of concepts so i'm going to give you some of the prerequisites that you need to know before you are going to watch that uh, watch that particular video right so first of all will be that is go to youtube and just watch some of the basic things from my node.js part 2 video why because this is this is where actually i have discussed the concepts of microservices ci cd docker each and everything in complete details okay so now let's go back and i'm going to give you some of the things that you need to know first you need to uh, understand or you need to know the basic node.js express concepts and typescript right because we are going to use typescript in node.js right so let's start one by one so you need to know basic typescript very very important right what are the concept of types interfaces generics node.js basics right npm scripts http fundamentals and you should be able to create some basic simple uh, rest api for example let's say express right and also you're going to use postman i'm pretty sure some of you already know postman once you know this you definitely definitely need to know nest.js so what you can do right you can search nest.js also so i had node.js part 4 and part 3 in both places actually i've covered nest.js fundamental in complete details if you don't know nest.js basics there is no way you are going to understand the concept of microservices okay so what are the things you need to know the project structure right what are the concept of main entry file app module feature modules controllers services dependency injections dto's validation each and everything i have discussed in this particular video so this will be the second prerequisite and this is very very important the third one will be microservices concepts and service boundaries okay now again this microservices concept is just like what is microservices and this also we're going to get from my node.js part 2 video if you know all of this this is better and then there are two more things if you know that will be very very helpful the first one is rabbitmq because we're going to use rabbitmq and message queues so you need to know these two things okay what is actually message broker and why we usually use rabbitmq in a microservices application second if you know some of the core concepts it will be very very easy for example uh, the concept of exchanges queues bindings all these things and at the end if you need to know some of the basic concepts of docker and docker compose right because we are going to use rabbitmq using docker only now if you again if you want to know docker i also have videos on devops right so you can watch this video also now see if i want I can easily explain all of this uh, when I'm going to upload this video but I thought it is very very important specifically you need to know these two things phase one and this phase two okay these two things are very very important you, to, you need to know node.js uh, basics typescript fundamentals and nest.js fundamentals or else you are not going to understand what you're going to do so as I mentioned so this will be a small video so that's all I wanted to explain 
once i'll upload the nature's microservices video watch this watch that particular video and i can guarantee whatever paid course you are going to take you can take it your all concepts will be cleared after watching that video again i'm going to repeat that is not the only video that i'm going to upload i'm also going to upload some more videos on kafka right for this one i'm going to use rabbit and queue but for next videos that will be more advanced uh, so be ready more videos are coming and i'm pretty sure the next video that i'm going to upload on next monday you are going to love it so that's all for this particular video i will see you in my next video till then good luck and peace